Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Ada, and if you are not, welcome back. A little over a year ago now, I posted my first ever K-pop reaction, and first off, it did so well, so to the people who watched that video, thank you all so much. But second off, it opened my eyes to this genre of music that I had really not known before, and now it is my most listened to genre. I have discovered so many different artists, so many new sounds, and I am just a really big K-pop fan now. So I figured to celebrate that video and my one year mark as a K-pop fan, we would do another reaction because a lot of new music has come out recently and I can only keep up with so much. Like I've been keeping up with the groups that I really love, but then I'll open YouTube and there'll be like four new songs on my YouTube recommended that I'm like, wait, when did that come out? I unfortunately had to retire the pink kitten headphones that I had been wearing in my past reactions because they finally died on me and I have no idea where the charger is, so I cannot charge them. So we're going to upgrade to the sage green AirPod Maxes and I will actually be able to hear myself when I talk, so hopefully I will not be yelling. But without further ado, grab a snack, grab a drink, put on your headphones, whatever you want to do, and let's react to some new K-pop. Okay, so the first song we are going to react to today is the reason I'm filming this video today. I waited until today to film this. It is March 31st, which means Jisoo has finally had her solo debut. I had to hold myself back so hard this morning when I woke up because it was the first thing on my YouTube recommended. I'm like, oh no, I need to wait until I film this video to give everyone my first reaction. I want to react with all of you. This already has 26 million views and it was released 11 hours ago. I say we just get into it. I have been waiting all morning to listen to this. Jisoo, I'm coming. Jisoo, okay. One last thing before we get into Flower by Jisoo. I just want to let y'all know, if you have not seen my past K-pop reactions, I normally do not react to the entire video. Just for like copyright purposes, I normally split it up and I'll leave in like the best parts of my reaction. But for Jisoo and Jisoo alone, we're going to do the full reaction. Chapter one. She looks so good. She's so pretty. Chills. Tears. I'm gonna cry. The looks. She looks so good. This purple look. This pre-chorus is so beautiful. <laughs> wow, Jisoo, oh my god. Jisoo! 
No, that can't be it. <gasps> oh. Jisoo, in my opinion, has one of the most unique and beautiful voices in the K-pop industry. And so when I heard that she was coming out with a solo debut, I was so excited. The song is exactly what I thought Jisoo was going to do. It's more slowed down. It's more chill. Like, the choreography isn't crazy. Like, Jisoo is not really a dancer. Like, I'm glad that she got to let her vocals shine. And that was the main focus of the song. Second... What I noticed even more than the vocals, if I'm being honest, was the looks. Every time that I thought I had seen every look that was in the video, a new one appeared. And then a new one. And then another new one. Like, what was the budget for this video? I know it was high. But, like, there were so many looks in this video right up until the very end. Like, new ones were coming and going, coming and going. I liked, weirdly, how she didn't really sing in the video. It was really just shots of her being gorgeous because... Jisoo is stunning, and there was like a storyline in the music video. I really wasn't paying attention. I know there were like words, there were like chapters in the video. Was I really paying attention? No, because I was stunned and mesmerized by her voice and her beauty. I am gonna have to rewatch this video. I definitely will. This is one I'm gonna rewatch a lot. I think my favorite part of the song so far is the pre chorus. Literally gave me full body chills. The first time I heard it, tears started to form. I am so proud of Jisoo, and as a Jisoo bias, as a Jisoo stan, literally makes me want to cry like i feel like happy mom i feel like a proud mom next artist we are going to react to is jimin and i don't really listen to bts but they are obviously everywhere i knew that he released a new album and he released two new music videos set me free part two and like crazy i've not seen either of them so we're going to react to both of them today and we're going to start off with set me free part two because this is i think the pre-release and it's the one that i've seen more of. Like, my friend Sarah is a hardcore BTS stan, hardcore Jimin stan, and she has made me a hardcore Jimin stan. And I've heard a little bit of it, and I was a little bit iffy, so I'm excited and curious to see what the full song sounds like and what the music video looks like. So, here we go. Big hit music. Okay. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> okay, Jim, and I see you. I see you. I got a good time. Yet time to get mine. Help us move, bro. I never stop. I never stop. It gets you with me. Uh, uh, uh. It's a little tattoo, Jimin. Oh, Jimin. Gotta give you props, because you deserve it. That honestly could left me a little speechless. Like, I don't know. Let's get the obvious out of the way. Jimin is a very talented singer, a very talented performer, and he is good to look at. And 
I think all of those together made me really appreciate how simplistic the music video was. Like, it wasn't any, like, crazy shots. There was no, like, crazy out there storyline. Like, obviously this music video has a story. It's very artistic. But I like how simplistic it was. I like how it was very focused on Jimin and the choreographers and the choreography. And it all really fit the song. Is the song my favorite thing in the world? No. Especially like the second verse or right when he like becomes shortlist basically and there's the writing all over his body. Like I don't like how auto-tuned that section sounds. And I think that would turn me off from like listening to the song like on my own or like on a drive to school or whatnot. But the music video is very beautiful. And Jimin is nice to look at. So I'm not complaining. I would definitely rewatch this just to like find things that I probably missed because there was a lot going on. Next up is Like Crazy, which I believe is the title track from his new album. This one came out, I think, last Friday. So it's been a week. I'm excited about this one. I've seen a lot of things. Sarah has been telling me all about it and has been trying to like catch me up on like the lore. And she has told me that there are like theories it's about like his masculine and feminine side maybe like his sexuality and i'm very excited to see this i've not heard any part of this song i must say i'm very excited for this one so let's go what is this asmr Okay. Oh, I really like this. Okay. Whoa. Oh, Jimin. Oh, okay. Oh. Give him his motherfucking flowers. A masterpiece. I love that. And I was like spaced out the entire time because I was so focused on paying attention to the lyrics and trying to understand what the story was in the song. I definitely am gonna have to rewatch this video because I can definitely see where people are like, oh, it's his masculine and feminine side, like especially with the woman in the music video. Like they never f actually truly interact with one another, which, you know, would make it seem like they're technically the same person, like two different sides of the same person. I really like this. The song is so, so good. I'm obsessed with the song, with the video, with Jimin, with the outfits, with the potential story. I like how it's inconspicuous. I like how with Set Me Free Part 2 and with Like Crazy, there's been a storyline, but it's not like right in your face. You have to read between the lines, which is why I'm going to go back and watch these music videos probably multiple more times because I'm intrigued. I'm curious. He leaves me wanting more. 
And I know there's an entire album that I still have to listen to, which now that I've seen these music videos, I'm really excited about. The next group I'm going to react to is In Hypen, and they haven't released any new music recently, don't worry, In Hypen fans, but I have been curious about them for a long time and I've never actually like taken the time to listen to their music. So I'm going to watch the music video for Paradox Invasion, which was their most recent comeback last summer. It has 25 million views, and I know they have a song called Polaroid Love, I believe, which I want to listen to, but I'm going to watch this music video first because it's the first one that popped up. Maybe I'll find another group to be obsessed with, even though I'm obsessed with like 50 million already and I'm going broke, so. Oh. I like his hair. I like his blue hair. Ooh, he hot. Come invade this. Let me look, let me look up their ages. And hype in members. Jung Won. Nothing hurts more than when I look up idols' ages and they're like all younger than me. And I'm not even that old. I'm like turning 22. He soon. He soon. I'm taking Korean on. I don't even know how to pronounce the name. Lee He soon. He soon. Who's the center? And who is an 01 baby like me? <sighs> Thank God. I didn't want to go to jail. But back to Paradox Invasion. I have heard the chorus before. I didn't know it was from this song. So catchy. And after watching this music video, I'm just more curious about like their other music. So I am going to go on my free time and listen to their other stuff, watch their other stuff. Unfortunately, another group that I have to bias, that I have to, you know, be a fan of. Like, these groups just want me to be broke. I'm curious to see what their other stuff is like because I really like this song. And if this is what their vibe is like, this stuff is going on the playlist. Obviously, I'm going to listen to it. It's just nothing super new, nothing fresh, but it's good. The, the formula works. The last music video we're going to react to today is one that I have seen, and it is from my favorite group, which you'll see in a sec. This is their most recent comeback, and it was also my most played song of March. So if you haven't seen it, you're going to see it now. If you have seen it, bop along with me because it's a bop. Like, I'm probably going to get up and dance because it's just that good. Mm, so good. Already. Wait for it. Jiho. Jiho with the lip ring. Oh, she's wet. Oh, Sana. The dance gets me every time. <laughs> gets me every time. Come on, Naya. It's over already? Oh my gosh. Can't end here. Oh, me <laughs> My girlies never disappoint. My girlies can never do wrong. I have absolutely nothing to say about this song because I've listened to it so much already and I've watched the music video to absolute death. And with that being said, that is going to be all for today's video and this reaction. I had so much fun and was blown away a multitude of times throughout this video. Like, 
Jisoo. I cannot wait to go back and rewatch it right after finishing filming this video. Jimin really blew me away with Like Crazy. Semi Free Part 2 was also better than I expected because I'd only heard like the auto tune part and I was like, oh, that doesn't really sound like something I would listen to. But it's actually like an okay song and the music video is fantastic and I'm never gonna complain about Shirtless Jimin with writing on his body. Like Crazy, masterpiece, literal perfection almost. I'm not, I'm not gonna pick a favorite. It's between Like Crazy and Flower for my most favorite new music video. Like, I'm not even gonna put Semi Free in there because I'm biased. But out of the four new videos that I watched, it's between Like Crazy and Flower for the top. They're like tied for first. And then Paradox Invasion and then Semi Free Part 2. But all the songs were good in their own right. If there are any other groups or songs you want me to react to, please leave them in the comments down below. I love doing these. And my original plan when I posted that first one was I was gonna do one like per month to keep caught up with music, and then I just never did that. And it's been like eight months, nine months since my last reaction. I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to like and subscribe down below. All my social medias are also in the description, Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter. It would mean a lot to me if you went over and followed me on those platforms as well. And with that being said, that is it for today. I really hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.